This is the second day. Actually, I think the third day I've been having a bad freaking day. I'm tired of this shit, okay? I'm getting so tired of my fucking computer screwing around with me, okay? Now, what's going on, guys? It is Shay here. Now, I'm sorry for that very bizarre intro, but I am having a bad day once I can get. Let's talk about it, shall we? So, I will talk about yesterday and what happened yesterday. Um, yesterday was also a bad day for my mom. It was a very bad day for her, actually. Actually, is my microphone up at a good level to the point where you can hear me? No, it's at like 57. I'm pretty sure you guys can't hear me. There we go. Now you can hear me a lot more. So, um, yeah, yesterday was a very bad day for my mom. Very bad day for me, too. Because, for one, all our plans got ruined because my aunt's over here now with a bunch of my cousins. They're all over here now. Um, some, one of my cousins sleeps on the other side on my brother's bed. My bro actually sleeps in there with my mom. Uh, he's in the car, 10. You know, you know, he can sleep on his own, like, on the other side. But, whatever. Um, they're going to be staying here for a while, so, um, I have to get used to that. Um, anyway. So. You guys may know that a couple days ago I made a video titled I am having a bad day, which is the day that PS3 got released on PC officially. And the freaking like the day that I got it, it wanted to say game 8.1.0 does not exist. And now last night it kept on telling me like it would never like it wasn't telling me the error. It just wouldn't let me go into anything because it would say connection timed out. I got pissed off, so I'm like, no, screw everything, I'm going, I'm just going to lay in my bed for the rest of the night. Um, and what happened last night, actually it was a bad night for both my aunt and my mom, because, you know, they're sisters. It was, it was a very bad night for both of them, because for one, I don't want to say it on camera, because I don't want to say any personal things on camera, any personal problems. My aunt's truck got stolen last night by a 14-year-old boy. 14, a year younger than me stole her truck and my mom found that out by i think um by one of my cousin's dad saying that the truck got stolen 14 years old and he went to go break into a boost mobile in a city somewhat far away from my from where i live um i think it was um snow point or something like that or something like that or snow hill right i think it was but um, I think it's near Wilson in my city or in my state, Royal Island. But he went to go. He went to steal. He went. He already committed a crime and was going to commit another. Was going to, I guess, double crime. I guess. But they both had a bad night. They didn't find the truck until today. I think this morning is what they said. So yeah. And then after that, I just I when I was able to play PS3D, it was working yesterday. And that new freaking um. The new, ah, uh, the new Death Run map that's been that's been put onto the game, I hate it. I absolutely hate it. The first night I played that, it took me 20 minutes. I think actually almost up to 25 minutes, and I didn't complete it. So I'm just like, are you kidding me? Can this night get any worse? And so I'm, I was just stressed out. I just didn't, I just did not want to do anything else. I was done for the night. I Laid in my bed. By the way, my bed actually has one mattress. I don't know if you guys can see it, but you guys can see that's my crotch. <laughs> you guys need to see that. But um, my bed only has one mattress. I'm most majority of the time I always have two mattresses, which is cool. But I don't have one because my brother had to take his old mattress back because since uh, he can't sleep in his bed, he has to sleep in or my mom's room. Um. So yeah, I was just so mad. I was so fed up with everything last night. Game the one. And I, I actually went off on a tangent, I'm sorry, but last night when I was actually playing PS3D, the Elite Rifle is starting to, I think I might actually end up, I think I might actually end up changing my primary for Curity Hunter, and probably rename the, the, my, that first loadout, because the Elite Rifle is starting to become bad, it takes way more shots to kill your enemy from body, it still takes almost the same amount of shots to kill your enemy with headshots, so yeah, but although they increased the rate of fire, it's nothing. They could have kept the damn thing the same way. So I'm just like, can this night get any worse? Well, I was hoping tonight it won't be as bad because I hopefully by tomorrow evening 
GTA 5 will be downloaded on my computer. If, actually, let me check and, uh, check and see what's currently on. Currently on 7%. This thing is going to take a while. Definitely a while to... Oh, crap. It's definitely going to take a while to uh, um, download. So, yeah, this day hasn't really been that bad. Um, you know, I got up, you know, I went to sleep. But the only thing is that the first thing that happened bad today was I didn't charge my phone this morning. Boy, the damn thing was on 12% when I woke up. So I'm like, dang it, dang it, dang it, dang it. So I went on and put on a charger, let it sit there. And yeah, and then Fire Blast started, you know, texted me um, and seeing, you know, you know, just, you know, don't talk or whatever. I'm going to try and talk to my hopefully then girlfriend because we don't really know each other like that yet. Uh, Fire Blast put us in a group on Discord where um, there, where he's trying to hook me up with a girl. Um, I'm not going to say her name in this video because I don't want to disclose anybody's identity. That's part of the reason why I use you people's YouTube names, especially that they have a YouTube channel. Now, they don't have a YouTube channel, then I just, I'm just going to have to use their names. But I'm not going to disclose their identity, but she's supposed to be my girlfriend, right? Out of all of my male friends I currently know, Every single one of them, even my friend Jaheem, has a girlfriend. And all my female friends that I know has a boyfriend. And actually, I think except for one of them. I'm not particularly sure if she really does have a boyfriend. But all my half of all my friends are in a relationship. And I'm the only one that is not. So if I can get to talk to her, if I can get to know her a little bit better, then maybe we, maybe I might just be getting in where, I, where I'm able to fit in. You know what I'm saying, me amigos? So, yeah, um, I just been having a bad day yesterday. You know, like, uh, cause we were gonna go to the stadium so I can, well, I actually go there to now to act out my script. And I actually really take, take, um, go out there and take and bring this. Uh, I bring, well, it's no real no problem because this is like a weapon. Weapon. It doesn't like a weapon. It's just like a, you know, like a phone, but whatever. Or it doesn't even like a phone at all, but, you know, whatever. You get my point. Um, I bring out this. The, this thing's not on. Um, this thing's not on, so I'm going to turn it off. But I take these two things out there. Secondary weapon, primary weapon. So if they add a, like, a Power Rangers or Super Sentai related weapon in PS3D, that does a good amount of damage. I might actually pick that over the elite rifle because the elite rifle is starting to get terrible. I tell you, um, maybe it's because I'm having bad luck and I'm not really giving the elite rifle or letting the elite rifle have it so I get to its full potential. So that way, I'm just this is video. This whole video is just a rant, okay? Don't mind me. It's just a rant, okay? So don't mind me. Um, you know, and then I was not able to sleep last night with my door, when my room, with the room door closed, because my mom said, I need to keep the door open to get to her to get some air. So I'm just like, can, can I please just get some alone time? I know I'm a teenager, so I know I'm 15, and I can't, I can't talk about my mom, even when I'm grown, even when you're grown, you shouldn't talk back to any of your parents, because regardless of what age you are, they can still backslap you, so... Yeah, you know, you know, I'm just like, can this not can like can this night get any worse, or can this night at least get a little bit better? And I just had a bad day yesterday. Um, I did get something new yesterday. Um, I got this pistol. Um, the it's called the Beretta M92 or M9. Um, or it's called the Beretta 92. Um, I actually thought this was the Taurus PT92, the successor to the Beretta, which was in Brazil. I spray painted it silver. It's silver paint already coming off. It was originally green. The slide was orange. I kept the orange tip. Um, kind of wish it was red, but I kept the well. The slide was orange. The hat, the lower body was green. Um, and I don't want to look like a. Hey, I'm holding. I'm playing with a toy. It might because if I painted this uh the the barrel silver or a different color, then people will probably think this is a real gun. And especially if I got all the right details on the Beretta. Because on a Beretta, the silver variant or chrome variant, there's the hand grips right here, right here on both sides are black. So, yeah, and then right here, there's a red dot to let you know that you're able to fire. Um, and it does have a blowback system, which reminds me a lot of a uh, airsoft gun. So, yeah, I mean, yesterday I was having a bad day, and not even a pistol, not even that pistol could let, could let me have any fun. So, yeah, I was just having a bad day overall. Now, do you guys think that yesterday could have been a little bit better if I would have kept my head up 
you know. And for those who may who saw that a video I uploaded titled um, "My Talk About the on the whole George Floyd situation type or thing" video was uh, my mom actually told me that it's not a very great idea to like give your own opinion out at this time because you know at this time people are going to rat like not they're people they're going to like call you out for basically calling you a bad person just because you made a video on your talk on it. Um, so I had to delete that video, and um, I didn't really care because, you know, um, you got to delete it, you know? So, yeah, yesterday was an overall bad day. Um, it was very gloomy, um, and it's only a couple more days until, I think, about seven, eight more days until I can get the stitches removed out, out of my ankle. And if my doctor, who... Um, who help? Who has been helping me from day one? Or actually, no, not from day one, because I didn't go to orthopedic on day one. I broke my ankle. I went straight home from the hospital after they put it back in place. Um, I would say, I would say probably near February, near the, probably first of February, or very, very end, or the very end of June, or very end of January. He's been there with me ever since. So, and he's saying, and my mom actually told me that if he says I'm clear. Um, then I can basically do whatever I want to. I'm free to do, like, stunts. Like, I'm able to do skits the right way again. I'm able to put socks on the bad foot proper properly. By the way, if you guys want to really see my foot, here it is. Uh, I'm going to take this. I don't want to take the socks off. This is, like, um, very hard to take, to put a sock on this foot, especially with stitches in it. Let me show you my foot. There it is. It might look normal, but this is a side. With stitches, these are the stitches right here, and they do actually do hurt from time to time. I will say that. And this, <laughs> I can't really show you this side, but this side actually has a scar from the stitches that used to be here. And I swear, when I take this sock up on the end of the day, or at the end of the day, it just feels so great just to massage my bad foot, especially near the area where the stitches have already been removed. Um, the top of my foot feels funny. Still, in a way, it still feels a little bit painful because they did say it was a little bit of swelling there a little bit, but not that much. Um, so, yeah, that's basically what my ankle or my foot looks like now. And right here is where that metal rod is in my foot. I think it's still in there. Well, it's it's still in there, I think, because it's definitely on it's definitely on this side. Um, but on this side, I don't know. But, yeah, that's what my ankle looks like. It might look weird. But I'm pretty sure you guys really, 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 really wanted to see what my ankle looks like, and my chair wasn't even down all the way. It's probably the reason why I was. It's probably I was actually wondering like why is my chair not down all the way. So yeah, and none of the stitches have came out ever since I got them in, which is of course the day on surgery. Um, but go ahead and uh, just try to slide it over my foot. It is, it is right there. I have to literally pull this side of the sock up just for me to put it on. Alright, alright, it's over. Okay, my headphones are still on the ground because I was in a rage moment. Um, now, my then girlfriend actually told me that she wants to be in my Curie Jour series, my Super Sentai series I'm currently making. Um, she wants to be part of the Curie Jour, you know, part of our actual team. Not just a character in the show, she actually wants to be part of the team. And I told her. You might be Curie Magenta because this is the, this is this color right here on this battery. Cimero is actually magenta, and there's a fan made uh, about say Ranger. Yeah, technically it's a Ranger, but a fan made Ranger called Curie Magenta, and I and her roll call name her roll call thing is supposed is going to be called the Lustful Hero Curie Magenta. And if I ever meet her and she's actually in the series, I will give her his, I will give her this battery because I don't want to see this damn thing in my face all the time. Okay. I actually want my battery, like the actual one you can brave in, you know, you can see the sparkle side and the, you know, and then charge, but I can't seem to find one that is for a decent price, because majority of the time for those, you have to go on a Japanese store or a Japanese toku store, yeah, I mean, so, yeah, I would give her this battery. If she, if I actually put her in the series, because I, because it was originally only just supposed to be seven, but then along came, I was like, we need a sixth ranger. Um, and there's technically no sixth ranger on my team, on a team of seven. Um, so there's now eight, but there might actually be nine, but she might be with 
Charity White, which is going to be which is the eighth character of our team. So she might get a battery if I ever meet her. I don't know, but yeah, I'm, I just yesterday I was having a very very bad day, um, and you can tell this video is edited because I actually have to put this in two parts, two freaking parts. So now I gotta go ahead and edit this video in, or I gotta go ahead, go ahead and edit this video and look at the playback of this video. Then go ahead and see what's up. So thank you guys for watching this video. I hope you guys enjoyed my rant. My rant is basically done. I just wanted to get this crap off my chest. I can't, I couldn't even record a video, a reaction video, because the freaking YouTube player wants to crash on me. So I'm just like, screw it. I'm just gonna probably, I'm just gonna probably play a game on my computer. To keep me company, and I'm gonna. It's, hopefully, it's gonna be. P, hopefully, it's going to be PS3D. And if it's not, I don't know what to say. Anyway, thank you guys for watching this video. My rant is done. If you guys like to make sure to comment, like, and or subscribe. And with that being said, I will see you guys next time. Bye, guys.